Good day to everyone. Today I would like to share how to reinstall Bluetooth driver in Windows 10 or 11. Let me show you how to do that. Yes, from a laptop or desktop, I would like to connect any types of Bluetooth device like a mouse or like a headphone or like an AirPod. So I cannot able to connect. But my Bluetooth drive and everything is healthy, but I could not able to find out where is the problem. So I'll tell you how to reinstall and you can able to enable the Bluetooth, what you have to do here. So on your Windows key, that is start menu, uh, from Windows 10 means it will be here and Windows 11 means it will be in middle. Just use right click and just go to device manager. So once you right click on that start menu means automatically it will move into lot of options options over here so just find out device manager once you hit the device manager in your right hand side click option it will open like a device manager pop-up window so here there will be a lot of device options will be available here you can find out the Bluetooth there will be a small arrow just hit the button small arrow so the Bluetooth devices what are the device will be there in your Intel core means everything will be display over here so here there will be a intel or wireless bluetooth is there so it is a uh, healthy uh, condition is good but it's not able to connect your uh, bluetooth headset what you have to do here so first and foremost just right click on that bluetooth device that is wireless bluetooth and just click uninstall once you click uninstall the device will be uninstalled from your laptop because it is not installed properly means it will not work with your things so it will ask you finish removing your things means you need to restart your computer just click yes option automatically you have to restart your computer once you restart the computer means it will show like a bluetooth as a semicolon mark will be there the warning mark will be there so you just need to reinstall the same icon what you have to do here so just right click and update the drives over here so just click update drivers and search automatically from the device and click close means the automatic device will be added over here so now you what you have to do here so your devices will be uninstalled successfully now so the proper installation is going to happen so that is reinstallation just go to action so once you click action option just click here for the scan for hardware change so once you click scan for hardware change automatically it will scan and plug and play everything it will scan and it will take your time to install your entire thing so it will refresh automatically so while the refreshing automatically the drivers will be updating as soon as possible so use this option only one time automatically it will scan your entire hard disk from your intel and it will move into the clear picture on your bluetooth so what are the information is there everything will be reconnecting your things so once you've done everything means just click a restart option automatically you will get your entire bluetooth will be work properly without any other delay so without any other thing it will be work properly what you have to do here just click a scanning option so once you scan a hardware change to entire scanning plug and play option once you complete the scan and play options so just use a right click on that scan as hardware changes automatically it will scan and tell you then you just restart your computer using your restart option once you click a restart option once you restart your computer then you are Bluetooth device will be work properly it will connect to your Bluetooth headphone mouse everything if you like this tips please share with your friends and subscribe my hobby channel thanks for watching dear friends have a great and good day